Good afternoon everyone, welcome to the channel. In today's video, I want to talk about string formatting in Python. I basically want to talk about three types of string formatting in Python. The percentage operator, the format operation and the f string finally. So let's get started. So at first I want to talk about the percentage operator. Okay, this is how this operator can be used. So, percentage is for a string, percentage D for integer, again another percentage d so we have to use this percentage operator then we need to provide the values so this will be a string name then is 41 and grand sums 20 so we are basically putting values within a string in string format is using the percentage operator so name Roger Federer is for grand slams 20 now let's see another example so a plus str i this is not really string formatting, but this is an example. But I want to do this same operation using the percentage operator. So we can do that very easily. We need to change only a few things. So for using the percentage operator, we have to mention the percent here. And since these are integers, percentage t, remove this and this, and remove this is here so we are getting the same output like that using the percentage operator okay now let's uh, check some floating point numbers okay so print floating point number we have to use the percentage f for floating point number so this will be so percentage f for floating point numbers now if we want values only after a certain point so let's say we only want the first three and by default the six values are being printed for floating point numbers now if we if we want only first three we can mention point three here okay now let's say if we want five we can do that and if we don't want anything we can just mention it then it will omit everything after the point okay that's uh, all about the percentage operator now i want to talk about the format method okay so we can we want to perform the same operations that we did using the percentage operator with the format method so we need to use the second bracket for format method dot format now we are getting the same output as this one using the format method we can also do some fancy things for this particular method so we can mention in which order they will come let's say 210 and C 
switch the position of this so we have reversed it basically and we still get the same output and we can also do this thing a little bit differently so we can use letters instead of numbers and also mention them here so sorry this is a this is b and this is c again it still gives us the same output now i want to perform this operation using the format method instead of the percentage operator so for that reason we have to remove the percentage part and mention the format so we get the same output using the format method now we can also do these things so for format method we have to remove percentage f this one second bracket and format format So this is uh, the floating point output using format method. Now let's if we only want the first three, then we can mention colon then 0.3f. If we want f so an extra zero just like uh, this one we can do that and if we don't want anything then we can use zero this will give everything before the point okay that's the format method now the last one the f string uh, this is the one that I like the most. Okay, let's repeat everything using the if string. So for if string, we have to mention if. We can just mention Roger Federer here. We have to mention everything within the bracket we do not need to use format or percentages this will be 20 and we can remove everything outside so same output as this one we are using the if string now the second part i want to repeat this part So instead of format, we have to just mention i here and also the if string outset. So we get the same output like this one using the if string. We can do this as well. So we do not need this format. if string and if we want only first three after the point we can do this or if we want extra zero we can do this or if we don't want anything after the point we can do this so this is how we can perform three types of string formattings in python the first one i showed is the percentage operator second one is the format method and last one is the f string 
I personally like this one because I think this is very convenient and I have used this one I think in uh, plenty of my videos so I also suggest to use this one because this is easy to remember actually we have to just mention F outside the quotation and put the values if these are numbers then we have to put the values inside the second bracket and if this is a string we do not need to put the second bracket and after that i want to suggest to use the format method in some cases but uh, i don't think this is very convenient and also a little bit difficult to remember so these are the three types of string formattings in python thanks for watching this video goodbye